Hey pilots, Drain Man here and today I have got a very exciting video. In today's video we are taking this over one year old drone frame build and we are going to upgrade the stack once again. This frame has been bashed and thrashed and trashed and taken outside and spanked and it has done nothing but push on again uh, talking new motors new stacks new antennas just over and over again and the frame just keeps on kicking this is a full aluminum frame and it has proven to be pretty damn good and here's the deal i want to upgrade the stack and this brand new stack came into me from diatone it is the mamba mk4 f7 mini paired up with the all new reactor 66 it's gonna be sick you're not gonna want to miss this Let's go. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> All right, pilots. I am stoked. I can't wait to put this stack in this frame and take it for a spin. No matter what I put on this frame, and it, it's a strong frame. It's made out of full aluminum, and I've got awesome videos on it. I'll link it for you down in the video description, but the thing keeps going. It is all scratched and beat. It really, really is, but it is not bent. It is not broken, cracked, sheared in any way at all. And yet I have to keep replacing motors and keep replacing stacks because the frame takes the hit and the electronics don't. So that is what we want from a drone frame. And I'm excited to keep this puppy going because whenever I have that really crazy trick that I want to try or something really stupid, I really do just put it on this one because who cares <laughs> it's been through enough so what i want to do now is take this brand new stack let's go ahead and crack this puppy open together we'll check it out we'll put it in and we'll take her to the sky okay so we've got a nice cart everything went mamba is usually just so nice and here's the plate that they normally use and they'll screw that stack to this actual plate which is super cool because it's mounted and safe and secure during packaging and traveling and shipping and everything else so let's see what it comes with. It comes with a bag of goodies. We've got our XT60 capacitor, grommets, gummies, wires, and screws. Very, very nice. So inside we have our stack. This is gonna be our flight controller, and holy cow, we're about to check that out. And here it is, the all new Reactor 66. I'm excited to check this puppy out. It is gonna be nice. And you know how Mamba does, some nice stickers, and then a full-on manual. You've got one for your stack, one for your flight controller. Oh, look at that, a practice soldering board. Very, very nice, which I don't need. I'm probably the best solderer you know. I know y'all have seen them joints and they on bleak. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. I love everything about it. I love the freaking really cool holographic sticker that they put on the MCU that has that like Mamba snake effect. I love the connectors. They're labeled. They take the positive and ground and they, they thread them together to help keep everything nice and neat. You can see inside the plugs, they go out of their way to put silicone or glue right here. See this? And then you've got your arrow right here. Okay, I'm not done. You've got bigger pads in the MK4 version versus the MK3. They've also added pad spacing to try to keep them apart. There, here's our gyro with gold leads. Oh my God, that's beautiful. And then right here on the side, you're gonna see there's these LEDs. And these are your indicators letting you know your gyro's working, your MCU's working, everything is working, your 3.3 volt rail, 5 point rail, your full battery VCC is on, working and kicking. So we've got dual back right here and these are synchronized backs, I can tell, they're beautiful. 301, you've got your full pads labeled, you've got your Betaflight OSD, your onboard flash, you've got a BMI, what is it, 270, and this does have a dual gyro option, and I think you can go anywhere from the MPU 6000 to the ICM 42688P, nice, look at that. God, I'm digging this thing. I really am. I would love to design this board and play with it myself. Okay, so we have some sort of jumper here in the corner, but it looks like it's already been soldered and taken care of. So 
you don't have to worry about it. Neither do I. And then we've got a USB Type-C. So this is very, very nice. And I'm thinking this plug right here is DJI. So it's just that simple. You've got DJI and your stack and you are in the sky. And look at this here. That is that Reactor 66. And I can tell by looking at it, You've got amazing, amazing filtration all over the place right here. You've got big, beautiful pads. They've created a separation between the motors. Can you see that? Look at that. And then you've got the big, beautiful MOSFETs. You've got your power and your ground, big, beautiful pads. If you flip it over, you still have access. You've got your microcontrollers underneath. You have a wiring diagram right here. But how cool is this? They're telling you the brand, what it is, Reactor 66, and then you've got all your specs right here. You know that it's got an input voltage, output voltage, your target if you were gonna need to flash, as well as knowing what you can run, and this is a BL Heli Sweet 32 board. So when you go to flash firmware or you go to pull up your configurator, whatever you're gonna run to program and work on this, you know what you need. Last and final thing really quick is if something happens to this connector right here, you flop it over and you've got all your pads Pads lined up right here just ever so beautifully I am absolutely impressed all right so I've got everything that I need right here I'm gonna slide this stack to the side I'm gonna crack this puppy open and I'm gonna put this stack inside and then we'll meet right back here in the middle all right, pilots, it came out absolutely gorgeous. Plug and play on everything. Big, beautiful pads on the ESC. I went ahead and soldered up my XT60 right here. My capacitor before was kind of ran underneath. Eh, not my favorite. So I went ahead and tucked one in right here and then wrapped the wires around and tied it in. I had plenty of grommets and gummies and spacers and everything. They came with everything. And because it's a 20 by 20 stack, they gave me mounting options four M2 and M3, grommets, screws, everything. So I'm gonna go ahead and power it up for you guys. I have a power supply right here. So I have this little balance lead with, you know, negative and positive. Mm. We'll crank this puppy up somewhere around 20 volts or so. Go ahead and connect my ground and let's go ahead and connect my positive. All right, so she's booted up and running beautifully. I have already jumped into beta flight. I already flashed new firmware. Easy, beautiful, nice. I went ahead and set everything up from OSD to ESC to calibrating my accelerometer. You will notice that I set my stack facing that way when it should be that way. So I had to do a little bit of turning and rotating and reorganizing my motors, but it was very easy, easy, easy stuff. And then as you can see right here, I've got all of my LEDs live and lit. All right, pilots, so that is going to do it for the MK4 F7 Mini with the Reactor 66, absolutely amazing. I'm gonna put my top plate on, I'm gonna put my GoPro mount on, and we're gonna take this guy to the sky. I hope that you'll stick around for the flight footage. I hope that you'll get your own Reactor 66, and I hope that you enjoyed this video, and I will see you on the next one. That's my hype girl, that's my mask No ones go for hours and some hours till we pass out Stay inside the house, turn up with the racks out Stay inside the house, turn up with the racks out Wow. If I got it, they got it, got it Family strong, they solid, solid For them empty my pockets If I got it, we got it, got it Foundation been solid, solid Taking off like a rocket, yeah I count money when I'm bored Watch the money hit the Make it rain, make it pour In my house don't need no tour It's just me and the fam It's just me and the fam It's just me and the fam It's just me and the It's just me and the fam Yeah, yeah 
It's just me and a fan Yeah, I love you, 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 so Yeah, I love you, 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 so I love you, 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 you,